Okay, so pull that plug out. It, it should be pretty easy. Just put the socket wrench on it, give it a little bit of a twist, and then you can do it with your fingers. Okay, now you can undo it with your fingers. No, I can't. <laughs> okay. I don't think it's doing anything. I don't think it's. What size socket do you have? I got the 1560. So, let me get. Maybe we need to go one size smaller. Yeah, yeah this is too big. It's slipping. Oh, yeah. the first time we tried it, there was a bunch of glue and ugly stuff built up on it. Okay, so we'll swap sockets. Just try that one, see if it'll fit. Oh. Too big. Go one size smaller. I want the tape on it. Seven eighths. Okay, seven eighths it is. Sounds like I'm in Vegas. You want red or black on that seven eighths? That's the right one. Seven eighths. So we need to change that little mark where we had fifteen sixteen. Don't drop the socket. Okay. <laughs> Here's your dipstick, just like an oil dipstick. Put it all the way down, let it touch the bottom. Okay, pound it a couple times in the bottom. Now pull it up and look at it. Now keep your fingers where they are. That's the top of the tank. Where's the water level? This tank's dry. So where's our water coming from? Well, there must be another water tank. I don't. It didn't get all the way down because it goes. The tank goes all the way down to the. Well, you're at the bottom. Huh? We're at the bottom. No, it goes all the way down to the uh, V and the keel, and we're no. We're not even close. So there's something blocking it. So how short are we? A couple of inches or a couple of miles? Well, we're short. Let me try it again. We'll just base it off that tag. Here, we're mark just, the we're, stick. We're right on the tag. Mark, mark the stick here. Does the Got stick it. all the way down? Yep. Okay. So we're there. No, I'm not dry. Okay, um, let me get the flashlight so I can scout around. But um, here you okay, go. So, black button at the top, the other top. Ah, okay. Yeah, it was right too. There's a hose in the way there. Okay, so I'm just going to come outside here. We're just guessing right now. Okay, so you're going down another seven or eight inches. Yeah, we're missing it by that much. Okay, There's so anything, that means this tank is not nearly full, so we'll use the water hose to fill it. The other thing we noticed, that water pump over there does not run. So right. that belt-driven water pump does not even run. Right. So if this is indeed the water tank that we're using, that water pump with the blue strainer on it yeah. is not the water pump because we're hearing a different water pump run back there in the engine room. Exactly. So I guess to finish our experiment, we can do one of two things. We can pull this cap out with a pair of uh, big channel locks because we don't have a wrench big enough, take the wires off and unscrew it, or we can fill the tank with water and see what happens then. But before we go anywhere, we've got to realize not only is that drinking water and ice making water, it's toilet flushing water. Yeah. So we need that water to flush the toilets. Um, okay, since this is, since these are no longer operational, um, we can plug them. But what I'm thinking is, where is, where's the hose? Where's the, where are those sure flows? Where are they pulling from? The sure flows are in the engine room port side behind the transmission. Yes. And where are they pulling from? We don't know. We'll have to go back in the engine room and follow the hoses. 
I'm, I'm looking so, at, I'm wondering if this, what do you think? This is the fill hose. That's right? the fill hose. The big hose is the fill. That's the air vent. That's the, okay, that's the air vent. And the gray hose is the water suction hose. And then that thing with the wires is your level gauge. Right. Let's get a pair of channel locks with the big opening jaw and we'll pull out that level gauge, see what it looks like. Okay. And see if we can see the water level in there too. Right. Okay, where's the cap? For the pin. Right there. Okay. Okay, uh, good luck.